um, yeah, there's some wire issue. Okay, let's see if we can work around with that. Uh, so I'm going to start with the, the very very basic. Uh, you know, let's say, uh, can we switch off the light? Let's say we are starting off a total new project. Uh, you know, for for development or maintenance, we are coming up with a blank slate. The very first thing that Kanban talks about is, uh, you know, you start with whatever you're doing. You know, whatever you're doing, you've been doing uh, existing. So let's say you have a development software maintenance process. So you know, the bug comes in, you have a queue of bug. It goes through analysis, it goes through fixing, it goes through validation, and then customer approval. So what it says is, you first try and visualize your process. You know, it could be in a physical board, it could be in a virtual board, you know, whichever way you're comfortable. You try and visualize that process. So the capability first capability that we allow, uh, you know, and a lot of Kanban principles that you see, you would see in our products with Kanban. Uh, just to as a, as a quick introduction before we go, we are a company called Digite. Uh, you know, we we build products for uh, you know managing the entire application lifecycle, uh, which includes any sort of a methodology. Uh, you know, be it uh, waterfall, iterative, RUP. Uh, we have a pro major leading product called Digite Enterprise, which is used by a lot of uh, bigger you know, IT organizations in India. Uh, Swift Kanban is a new product which we are very focused on Lean and Kanban because we see uh, that this is going to be the next wave of uh, software development. Uh, a lot of companies are you know, now trying uh, you know, more and more flexible and agile ways of working. Uh, and it is not, Kanban is not limited just to software. A lot of non-software uh, you know, uh, development companies are also trying Kanban. You know, for example, we know of a bunch of HR folks who use Kanban board uh, to, do, to visualize their process and manage the work. So sort of a Kanban has a much more larger universal appeal uh, you know, and that is where it is gaining uh, traction. Uh, so this is a product Swift Kanban. So uh, what I've just landed up is I just created a new blank board. Let's say you're starting off and you're trying to visualize your value stream. One of the capability we'd give you is uh, you could go as complex in your value stream it could be because a, a lot of teams have multiple team dependencies. So you could actually you have to visualize the entire process including multiple teams in a single way. Uh, so we give you a lot of capability to, to define your board. Uh, the very first thing that you can do is it's as simple. We can build the whole damn thing. Uh, let's say you have a you want to have a process which is in between. So you will say analysis. Yeah, sure. Uh, we have a, a, a new platform that we have actually launched, Sif Sync. Using that, we have an integration with 10, 15 different tools. So you can actually integrate. TFS is one of them. Jira, Bugzilla. You know all those tools you can go and integrate. So tickets from flow in from there and, and move, and then you take this workflow. Okay. So so basically you can build. So for example, I just added a stage. You could split 